Hi, this is Ms. Prather. I'm going to show you how to use Biography Reference Center. You can get to that um, if you're a Hendricks student on your library web page and then go to Middle School Resources or Research Tools, which is this page. If you um, also, you can just type in catalog.pisd.edu. It will take you to this page and you click on Middle School Library Resources. Either way, you're going to get to this page and here where it says biography, biography reference center is here in the middle. This is a re resource that's real good if you're trying to um, research a person, especially a historical person. If you're at home like I am right now, you're going to have to enter our username and password for at home usage. Your teacher and your librarian will be able to tell you what that is. For my students, you can get it on our website, the library website, through a um, password protected page. Anyway, here is the main page. You're going to type in who you're looking for, if you know specifically, or you can look by categories. Here's some different categories on the right, or you can just browse people if you want to. But usually if you're using this, it's because you're looking for somebody specific. So let's say I'm going to do Thomas Jefferson. So if I type in Thomas Jefferson. Now, what I was surprised to find is that you'll see here, it's not the first Thomas Jefferson I'm thinking of. This is Thomas Jefferson Far Farnham. Then there's Wood. Then there's Van Alstine. The one I want is the president. And... If you look at this, these are all other last names. So I could go through pages and pages and find it, but that takes too long. What I can also do is if I go here to advanced search, I can use the same Thomas Jefferson, which I already have, but I can add here, since I know his occupation was president, I'm going to add that president and let's see if it narrows it down for me. Um, Sorry, I just hear it. I'm sorry, you have to go back to the search. I forgot. Okay, go back to the search. And now here we go. It tells me Thomas Jefferson, American president. Okay, so when I click on this, it's going to give me a bunch of other articles about Thomas Jefferson. So here's just a real basic synopsis of some of his achievements so that I know I'm on the right person. But when I, have, I actually want to read his biography, um, then I need to click on these different links. What I've discovered is if you click on this here, it just gives you information about the actual article. It doesn't give you the article itself. So you've got to click on the thing that says HTML full text. If I go back so you'll see it, you don't have to come to this page. You can just click on it right here underneath. See this right here at the end? There's these numbers. The higher the number, the more difficult or long the text is. So if you're wanting to find something maybe shorter or easier, um, then look for a, a smaller number. Um, but anyway, if you'll see here underneath is all of the HTML. So that just means it's been copied and pasted the text into the in internet, basically. So if I click here, I'm going to get the whole article, all the text that I of that specific resource. Now this one's pretty short. Um, I can cite it and where I went wrong in this resource, see where it says here citation, that's not the citation format that you want if you're doing research. You want to come over here instead to where it has this and then cite this article and then we use MLA. So you'll want to copy and paste the MLA. Okay, if I go back, now look, you want to go back and not go to name list. If you go to name list, it's just going to give you an alphabetical list of everybody in this resource. If I want to go back to the actual search that I did, then I just click here back and I'm, I'm back to this. Um, you'll notice that most of them say HTML. There's a couple, there's one right here that says PDF. PDF is just a picture of the actual article. So in this case, it's like in a dictionary. Um, and so you would see it in that way. And that's